What's going on guys? Here with Artie Tech. Welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon White Platinum, the Nuzlocke run. In the last episode, we took on the 7th gym of the Zerhi region, and we got ourselves a shiny new gym badge. We are so awesome, with only 37 hours of game time so far, so <laughs> that, that seems a little, a little off. Maybe just a tad bit. So anyways, today we are going to begin our journey towards the final gym in this region. And, um, which, in case you didn't know, because I did spoil it in the last episode, is a dragon type gym. Now, I have no idea how far away this gym is, if we're going to be reaching this town in this episode or not. But, um, yeah, oh, uh, wait, what are you doing back out here? Didn't we already beat you? Well, Hardy, today I made an important decision. I'm going to. S what? Wait, what? But we. We already did this battle. What? I'm so confused. <laughs> we already... I would have swore we already battled her. Am I... Am I crazy? Or... Um... My brain... Why do you have an orange berry, of all things? Oh, great. You're gonna be... Okay, you know what? Um, I should probably switch out. So... Why? I, I'm, like, positive. I already faced you. And, but you're still just standing here, like, confusing my brain. And my brain doesn't appreciate that. Anyway, so, um, thank you, thanks to you wonderful people in the comments telling me that Roxy, if, if it's going by 5th gen moveset, actually won't learn Thunderbolt. And the only move he'll actually get, she'll actually get my level up now is Thrash, which I probably won't keep anyways because it locks me in and that could be really, really stupid. So, I probably won't be doing that, but, um... Do I have anything to heal up with? I don't want to have to run all the way back. It's so far away. Oh, I got plenty of hyper potions. Wow. Um, let's put someone else up front. Kekles has done a lot lately. Let's put Fruit Loop. He's got to catch up just a little bit more. Anyways, what was I saying? I actually completely forgot what I was talking about. So, I hope it wasn't important because it just it completely blew my mind. Right before I recorded this. Uh, for some reason, I've like really gotten into Chugga Conroy lately. Like for a long time, I didn't really watch like chugga but i started i watched his super mario 64 ds let's play and i watched the beginning of his leaks awakening let's play i didn't watch the whole thing but i liked his super mario 64 let's play i actually haven't watched any of his pokemon let's plays before and i've been watching his kid icarus uprising let's play and i just watched part three of that which just came out recently and so what's going on here who are you have I met him before? Hardy, the Pokemon Society finally learned the location of Team Steam's base and they hint about their real plans. We know now that they're after something in Dark Drake Breath City. Drake Breath. That's odd. And their base in the, it's just south. Ash Ketchum told me to have Team Steam uniform. That you have a Team Steam uniform. That's a perfect way to infiltrate their base. We have many hypoth hypotheses about their true goals. But one thing we know is that... One thing we do know is that they'll initiate the next phase of their plan soon. We've seen a lot of movement from their members in all different cities. Please report back to us with any information you'll find. We're running out of time. Oh my god, someone actually talking to us? It's not a rival battle? That's possible? Wow, awesome. Um, anyways, as I was saying, I was just watching part 3 of Chugga's Kid Icarus Uprising Let's Play. And in this, he ended up making a joke about someone stealing his donuts. And when I saw this, like, my very first reaction was, Oh my god, Chugga watches my videos. Because that's probably, like, one of the more well-known moments for my channel is in um, Emerald Randomizer with, like, the Rayquaza Groudon and Calgar scene. And, uh, I like, I know, obviously, he wasn't, like, refer referencing me, but it made me so happy. I'm like, oh my god, Chugga knows who I am. He watches my videos. I'm so famous. But... It, it made me happy that he did that. So, um, you know what? I'm, I'm gonna do it. We're giving him Thunderbolt. He deserves it. We've had... Roxy's been very amazing. I think Roxy and Rusty are, like, our longest tenured Pokemon now. They've been with us since, like, before our very first gym. And they're still with us all this time later. So, Roxy, I, I have faith in Roxy. Now, I'm pretty sure this is gonna be the episode where Roxy dies. But... You gotta admit, considering like how I've done in past Nuzlocke, considering this game can be rather difficult, it's kind of... I'm a little impressed with how well I'm doing, the fact that I still have Roxy and Rusty alive. I've only lost, I think, 
eight Pokemon? Is that how many I've lost? I haven't, I haven't paid enough attention to how many Pokemon I've lost, but I got, I love when you surf. It looks so cool. And I, I like the sprites that have like the Pokemon, the trainers sitting on the Pokemon. I never even like realized, except for like the main characters, I didn't realize this game just added like custom random trainers as well. And it looks so cool. So a lot of credit to whoever made Light Platinum. I really need to figure out who made Light Platinum because I keep praising them and it's like, this is probably a new route and I probably could have caught a Pokemon and I probably failed, which sucks because I could have caught a Remoroid and named it like after Rusty again because of Octillery. But oh, poop, what did I just walk on to? Today is a great day. Percy and I, your leaders, will finally be enacting our... Do they not realize the random dude just standing there? Team Steam, in a few hours, we will have enough power to bring the world under our rule and enforce peace. Let's go, Team Steam. Hurry and execute Plan Alpha. Seriously, I'm just, I'm chilling right here. How does nobody notice me? Really? Are you guys just like that? Okay, so I'm assuming I'm supposed to put on a Team Steam uniform. Do we really only have three key items after this entire time? Huh. Hey, girl, hey, you, get going. The entire team is ready to execute our plan. Hurry up. On my way, sir. Okay, let's put on my uniform again. No, I can't. Never mind. Why does it just magically come off? I don't know. But anyways. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's personal. Can enter Team Steam's base. And yet, I'm just standing here being cool because I'm awesome. What you going to do about it? Yeah, nothing. Mm-hmm. That's what I thought. Yeah. You ain't going to do nothing, are you? Uh, let's give Fruit Loop a lucky egg. I think we have one sitting in our bag because we did have two. And Fruit Loop deserves one, so... So, let's go take on the trainers. Team Steve's ready to rule the world, yay! Because I'm a little grunt and I'm just going to lose because I'm pathetic and my team hates me and I just want to go home. I don't like this anymore. I'm such a sad little bit grunt and I, I didn't even want to be a grunt, man. I didn't choose this life. The, the grunt life chose me. I didn't have a say in the matter. I wanted to go to school. I wanted to be an engineer, man. I was going to play with robots. I was going to be awesome. But, but no, now I'm here. And I have to be a grunt, and I have to play with weird fucking weird... Did I just say what I think I said? I apologize, but... Now I have to play with like, them weird goofy cats. I don't like playing with the weird cats, man. I, I, don't, I, just, I don't. It's not my thing. I, mean, I like cats, but... Have you seen Poor Ugly Man? It's ugly. It's all fat and stuff. It looks like someone just stuffed like a, a million pillows inside of it, and it freaks me out so much. I just... I, all I wanted to do was be an engineer, man. I just wanted to play with robots, but no. <laughs> no. Okay, so I'm assuming, just guessing, like seeing these two trainers in a row, I'm assuming this is one of those areas where every trainer has the exact same team. So, the good news is we'll be able to beat them. The bad news is it gets extremely repetitive, extremely fast. So, that's n that's definitely the bad news in this situation. And I should probably give Fruit Loop a Hyper Potion because Fruit Loop is like on half HP. But yeah, okay, this is like the third trainer and I'm already getting bored of this. So, uh, do we have like any, uh, um, Rusty hasn't done anything in like a long, long time. So you know what, Rusty, we'll let you have this guy. We'll let you earthquake the fat cats. Um, I almost feel tempted to just like skip all these trainers that have the identical trainers or the identical Pokemon because it's so repetitive and it's so boring, but... I, I, I'll think of this as a challenge to try to make this entertaining in some way because it, it, it's possible for you to have something that not even I can make entertaining, which, okay, yeah, you know what, screw this, I'm just, yeah, bye. Alright, to probably no surprise, all the trainers on this floor are the exact same Pokemon, so let's go see if this floor is any different, yay, I, I bet this guy, he's probably going to have like a Krogunk, he's going to have a Krogunk, he has three Pokemon, that's not a good sign, if it's a Glammeo, I'm going to scream. It's Glamio! Yay! I hate this game. Oh my god, guys, we found someone with different Pokemon. It was the fourth trainer on this floor, I believe, and he has a Magmortar, and he's now like my best friend, and the Magmortar's dead, but I don't care. We finally found other Pokemon. That's like, just like all I've wanted, because it's literally just been Glamios, and more Glamios, and more Glamios. And they're just, they're everywhere, man. It's. <laughs> It's made my life so horrible, but they're gone now. The Glammeows are gone. They're not going to hurt us anymore. It's okay. You can come out of hiding. I promise it's safe. The mean, mean monsters have gone away, and they won't come back, okay? I promise. It's, it's okay now. The world is okay again. 
No more glammy house, no more per uglies. Oh, I couldn't be any more happy. Yay. Oh, cool. I was like, I was really afraid that it was like going to go back to the glammy house and I was just going to be like, no. But it didn't. We finally have new Pokemon. That's all I ask for. I mean, I know that like every freaking rocket guy has like a Zubat and a coughing. But at least they add like a little bit of a diversity. I mean, not every single guy has a Zubat and a coughing. Nate, what is TM16? I don't know. What is that? White screen. Okay, probably won't use that. But I mean, it may be useful for like 20 bucks. I mean, is that? I don't know how much like Poka, Poka dollars are worth. But I, I would give someone 20 bucks for a TM. Like in real life, that's what like um. Rock Slide is a direct upgrade to Rock Throw, so I definitely won't say no to that. I mean, that that's what, like, real CDs are worth, right? Like, about 20 bucks US. I don't know what they're worth, like, in the UK or in Japan or Canada. I don't even know what currency Canada uses, so I'm pretty sure in Canada you just pay other people with leaves. I might be wrong, but, I mean, they have a leaf on their flag, so... There's something a little weird going on there, if you ask me. But I, I try not to question it, you know. It's their thing. They they can do whatever they want, as far as I'm concerned. And I won't judge them. But I know I have can I have Canadian friends. I know I have Canadian subscribers. If you guys can clear this up for me. Is your currency Leafs? Or is it like beer or teeth? Because I know hockey is really big out there. Do you guys pay each other with teeth? I feel like I might like be starting to insult you guys and if I am I apologize but um don't be insulted you know it's all just like jokes I I don't actually think any of you pay each other in leaves although that would be amazing because I live in a forest and I could use something I need something to do with all the leaves around my house because I could just like put them all in a bag and go to Canada and just be like a billionaire that would be pretty freaking amazing if I do say so myself. So, Canada, I'm looking at you. I'm going to come be your president. Actually, I don't think Canada has presidents. I think they have, like, prime minister or whatever. I think there's, like, a Canadian prime minister. I don't think Canada has a queen. I should be Canada's queen. Yeah, you know what? That's going to be my goal in life now. The uh, Some people, like, want to grow up to be a major league baseball. Oh, my God, it's Glamio again. Yay! Some people want to grow up to be like a professional baseball player. Some kids want to grow up to be a fireman. I want to grow up to be Canada's queen. And I'm going to do it. I'm going to be the best queen that Canada's ever seen. I'm just going to blow Canada's mind. And I'm going to make this whole tree thing with the leaves and the currency. I'm going to make that happen. So Canada, watch out. Like everywhere you go, it's going to be leaves. Leaves, beer, and maple syrup. That's how life should be. You know how America's all about like apple pie and baseball? <laughs> no, screw that. It should be about leaves, beer, and maple syrup. I'm going to make this happen, America. Canada. What country was I talking about again? Whatever country I'm talking about, I'm coming and I'm going to take over and we're going to have a party and it's going to be amazing because I'm going to be Canada's queen. Party take yo yo for queen. Okay, we got a boss fight coming up. Is force double battle, so I'm I'm satisfied with how we're looking. Let's do this. I'll show you that you shouldn't come here. This time I'll defeat you. I've always hated you for interfering with our plans. I'll use that hatred to beat you. You stupid, 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 stupid traitor. Oh, okay, it's not a double battle, so she's gonna. I, I'm okay with her just sitting there like awkwardly watching. I mean, I can get into that. I mean, voyeurism is, is a-okay in my book if that's what you're into. Okay, is that really all you had was an Absol? Really? I'll show you that you shouldn't have come here. I am a female, but I have this voice. I take a lot of steroids. This time I'll defeat you. I've always hated you for interfering with our plans. I, wait, wait. This seems awfully familiar. Didn't I just read this somewhere? I'm not 100% sure, but it seems really familiar. Speaking of reading, I am actually reading a book currently, and um, I don't. I like to read. I really, really like to read, but I never really find books that interest me. And recently, I picked up The Ultimate Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy, which has all five books in, like, one book. So I've been, like, quoting it on Twitter the past few days, and it's been 
making me happy. So, anyways. Mine is ready as well. Now it's time to execute the final phase of our plans. We're going to capture and clone Arceus. Imagine an Arceus in every town, in every city, all under our command. They would ensure that all our world orders are obeyed and install a regime of fear where peace will finally reign. Everyone will be equal. No one would be different from anyone else. No hunger, thirst, or violence would ever exist in our world. You know what, that actually sounds like a good plan. Why am I stopping these guys? Go forth and act the final phase. Capture Arceus with the Alpha Ball. That really hurt my throat. I need to stop that. You know what, while they're walking away, I'm going to take a quick drink of water. So we're just going to awkwardly stand here for a second. One second. You see, I paused the video for very random things. Like, I feel the need to pause it when I have to face a million Paraguays. But when I need to stop and take a drink, I'm like, you know what, you guys are just going to sit here and listen to me drink because that's totally not weird. Okay, so, uh, are we are we supposed to go on this side now, I guess, or what? <laughs> oh, dude, a Master Ball, wow. I was just like walked right by this. Okay, that would have sucked. If I just... I'm sure there's someone already like yelling in the comments that I forgot a Master Ball, but nope, I found it. No need to worry. So we are back on Route 416, and I guess we're... Supposed to continue on this way, I assume to Drake Breath City. Um, I don't really like want to take on the trainers, but Roxy could still use some XP. So, does Kekko still have the lucky egg? Kekko's, you don't need that. Stop hogging the lucky egg. Roxy, Roxy needs some eggs. Roxy likes eggs. Roxy, how do you like your eggs? I really like scrambled egg sandwiches. Are delicious. So, if you guys are ever gonna make me a sandwich, make it a scrambled eggs. Oh, do we force up that way? What? Did I, did I miss something? I'm so confused now. But anyways, apparently we are at Drake Breath City, which, you know what this means. Time to hunt every single location in this entire world for an event Pokemon. Or, not an event Pokemon, a gift Pokemon. Oh, God, that's a rival battle. I could already see. Well, I don't know. He looks like everyone. He looks like this guy. Okay, what do you have to say? The gym is temporarily because of the Team Steam attacks. My apologies. Okay, that's cool. The Team Steam like... Ex a, oh, what are you going to say? Sorry, but no ordinary people are allowed to enter here. Do I look ordinary you? I'm literally like the only person in this entire town that's wearing unique clothing. And now you're just here saying that I'm not ordinary. Sir, I don't appreciate that. So, let's go find out what our event Pokemon is. I keep saying event. I'm looking to see what I have to do today. I'm a dragon apprentice. Um, never use water, grass, or fire Pokemon against a dragon type. Ah, The Pokemon Center is well designed. Yes, yes. Uh, it, the dialogue in this game, man. Okay, well... I'm going to go Pokemon. Oh, oh, what, what do you say? I've been training this backup for so long that he and I are inseparable. That's so adorable. Bag, 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 bag. I think he's like begging for me to kill him. <gasps> it's a supermarket. Oh, that's nice. Anyways, I know there's going to be something interesting. Oh, I bet it's you. Is it? It's you. You can tell just by looking at some trainers today have capacity to train certain Pokemon really well. I'm willing to give you a great Pokemon. Oh, God. What is it? What is it? What is it? Oh, I don't like Axew. No, I don't, I don't want it. I don't like Axew. But if there's no other Pokemon, I may have to come back. What is down this? Oh, don't jump over that ledge. I think if we do that, we'll be trapped. Or we'll have to go back all the way to the other town. But we do have Fly, so it's it's whatever. Anyways, are, are we done at that Team Steam building? Because I'm kind of confused now. Because I don't see anything around here to do. Um... Uh, what do you what do you say? I bet you're interesting. Okay, you have the same dialogue as the dude in the Pokemon Center. That's okay. Who needs to be original in this game? Um, so obviously we've done every single thing in this game, and now this is where we're just supposed to go and live for the rest of our life. So uh, that's okay. Thank you guys for listening. This is obviously the end of White Platinum now because there's nothing. To, well, okay, game, game, game. What are you doing? Game, stop. Okay, my game is, is stuck going down, so um, this game, uh, I obviously want to go down on this tree, and you guys can't watch that. So thank you guys for watching. Until next time, I'm Marty Tech Yo-Yo. Peace! That means bye.